In this video I'm going to show you how I built an Adreno based fencing accuracy trainer, the Fensomat. The Fensomat will highlight a random hit area in random intervals for a short time that has to be hit to score. After 10 successful hits it plays the win sequence and starts all over. The best thing about it, it is powered by 5 volt via USB, therefore it can be easily connected to a common power bank and used wherever needed. It consists of three parts, the electronic setup, the hit plate and the dummy cushion. Electronic setup. The multicolor LED is most important, it interacts with the fencer. Power and ground is connected in parallel. The data cable is connected in serial from the first to the nth LED. An Arduino based board runs the code and detects the hits. This nano-sized board nicely fits into a 2.5 mm PVC pipe for protection. Plus is connected to the 5V port, minus connects to ground. The data port cannot handle the full power from the Arduino, therefore it connects through a 500 ohms resistor to D13. For each LED there is a corresponding wire grid that connects to D2, D3 all the way to D9. A long wire connects to ground and to a crocodile clip. The power and ground port of the USB connects to 5 volt and ground of the Arduino. When the crocodile clip is connected to the center plug of the RP and the wire grid is hit, the Arduino now detects what grid was hit. The fence or mat will take a lot of hits. That will stress and eventually break the soldered connections. Therefore some strain release are added here, here and here. The hit plate. The plates are made of acrylic glass, roughly 5 by 6 cm. The corresponding wire grids measure 4 by 5 cm. A 7 mm hole in the middle fits the LED. The wire is soldered to the middle of the wire frame and fed through the hole. Hot glue keeps the wire in place on top of the acrylic glass. Wires are soldered to the LED. The direction of the LED is marked on the back. Hot glue holds the LED on the back of the acrylic glass. More glue sticks some fabric on each side of the back of the acrylic glass. The dummy cushion. Fake leather is cut to a fitting shape. The wires of each hit plate are fed through small holes in the leather. The LEDs are connected as described before. The three remaining LED cables and each cable from each wire grid are guided to the lowest part of the leather. After testing the connections and labeling the wires, the hit areas are sewed on the fake leather. A matching piece of fabric is sewed on the back of the leather, creating a weird bag. After stuffing it with cloth, the last gap is closed and some handles are added. The Arduino is connected as described, the code is uploaded and the fensomat is ready. Thanks a lot for watching. A full list of all parts and a link to the code can be found in the description below. Have fun fencing! By the way, to also train your German word puzzling skills, check out the speller.app for Android. The word Fechten is rewarded with 2366 points.